Groovy, Phoebe, this is not a place to play with the ball. Be careful, you are going to break something. Why don't you stop playing and enjoy the museum? You two love dinosaurs. Pops, you look weird. Are you okay? Kids, do you know what is happening? Hoverboard? Carousel? Broccoli? Surprise egg? Fire extinguisher? Nice try, but I think she is angrier now. Try to blind her with a flash. Kids, what do you think Groovy should transform into to scare the mummy? No, Groovy, transform into a dinosaur. <laughs> what have we learned, kids? No balls allowed at the museum. Pops, what are you up to? Pops has opened a portal. Where does it go? Pops, have you brought us to the era of dinosaurs? We are at the Jurassic. Wait, kids. This can be very dangerous. Phew. At least we have Groovy who can transform if we need it. This Brontosaurus seems very nice, though. Those T-Rex, not that much. Kids, look. What's that? It's a dinosaur egg, like the one in the book. And it's in danger. Groovy, you have to do something. Kids, we must save the egg. Groovy, you can. It's there. Oh, oh, run. Kids, how do you think they can do it? Pops, I have an idea. A pterodactyl, that's right. Now you can save it and take it back to its nest. Well done, kids. They're like the ones in your book, Phoebe. Do you want to keep playing? Well, what kind of dinosaur will they be? Brontosaurus? No, Phoebe, they can't be Brontosaurus egg. Brontosaurus are huge to live on top of this little hill. <laughs> Tyrannosaurus Rex? No, Groovy, they can't be from a T-Rex. T-Rex can't fly, and it would be too difficult for them to feed the babies. <laughs> That's it, Pops. It must be a dinosaur that can fly. Do you already know what dinosaur it is? Exactly. Pterodactyls. <laughs> oh, and they think that you are their mom. Oh, that's their real mom. She's 
very grateful. Good job, kids. Oh, wow. What a long day, kids. It's time to go to sleep. Good night. That's the way I like it, kids, to wash your teeth after every meal. With a little bit of toothpaste is enough. Be careful, Pops. You're going to create a magic portal. Groovy? Oh, a baby dinosaur. Hello, baby. Don't cry. Groovy, please transform yourself into something. Something that babies like. I do not know. A pacifier. Groovy, look at your steak, Groovy. You're full of dinosaur slime. What do you say, Pops? Yes. Okay. Children, Pops is right. Our little friend has sneaked into the present through a magic portal. We have to travel back in time to find their parents. Is that all right, little dino? Pops, please open the magic portal. Ready for a time traveling adventure? arrived. Welcome to the Jurassic. It turns out that before humans, the Earth was inhabited by these huge dinosaurs. What do you think? <laughs> Groovy, we need a vehicle to escape. No, Groovy, no. Something that goes faster. Run! They are T-Rex, the most dangerous dinosaurs! Good. We've given him the slip. We'd better find the parents of our little friend. This Jurassic is dangerous for a human. Two Martians and a voiceover. And now what? Oh no! Another dinosaur is coming! Luckily, he has come to help us! It's a harmless Triceratops. Oh, it's your mom! What a happy coincidence! Well, kids, problem solved. He can come back to present. This must be his dad. Oh, poor, he has a Flemigan. Of course, as at this time, they did not wash their teeth. It is normal that it hurts. Groovy, could you help him? <laughs> circles, circles, up and down, three times a day, and smile, smile, smile. <laughs> Goodbye, friends. Kids, not so fast. What are you forgetting? Right, you have to brush your teeth. Remember, to the dentist you won't go if you wash your teeth more. It's a beautiful day to play at the beach. girl wants to play too. Why don't you throw her the ball? The more we are, the more fun we'll have. Huh? She stole the ball. She's not a girl. 
She's a mermaid. Phoebe, where did she go? We'll have to use the GPS. Groovy! Good morning, Mr. Seahorse. Have you seen a little mermaid with a ball? Hey, Mr. Swordfish. Haven't you seen a little mermaid by any chance? Miss Jellyfish, have you seen a mermaid swimming around here? No? Sharks! It would be better if you just run! I'm sure that if we try to talk to them, does someone speak shark? No? And whale? <laughs> nice try. But I think it didn't work. We are safe by the skin of my teeth, thanks to this friendly family of sharks and their three delightful fried rice. Friends, sharks, we are looking for the mermaid who took our ball. Do you know her? <laughs> they do. Let's follow them. This is an authentic Spanish galleon. It sank centuries ago. Maybe there's a... a treasure. Whoa! <laughs> Look, children, there she is, the little mermaid. And she keeps her own treasures. Yes, Phoebe, that's our ball. But she's not giving it back to us. For her, that ball is a treasure. What if she keeps it and gives us this luxury collars in return? Everyone happy. Although the best thing about having a ball is to play with your friends. Haha, <laughs> what an aquatic adventure we live today. And we've learned that what for one is not important at all, for others is a precious treasure. What a beautiful spring day! Kids, look! A bunny! Is it the Easter Bunny? Are you ready for the Easter egg hunt? For all the kids? Wow, what a weird machine! Is it to paint the eggs? One, two, three, four, and five! There are five eggs! And what colors will they be? Red? Yellow, blue, pink, and golden! It's the golden Easter egg, the most difficult to catch. Let's hide the eggs. Red one inside the bush. Yellow one, hmm, behind the tree. Hmm. And the pink one, behind the mound of stones. Ha <laughs> ha, great! Ready to play? Groovy's found an egg. It's a dinosaur egg? 
No, Groovy, it's an Easter egg. The Easter Bunny has hidden surprise eggs. Wow, a police car. The Easter egg hunt has started. Let's find all of them. Groovy's found an egg. There was a fire truck inside the red egg. And the rest of them? Where are they? The yellow one. Can you see it, kids? Tell Groovy where it is. That's it. The yellow egg was behind the tree. So cool. A yellow excavator toy. Kids, do you see the pink egg? I know where it is. <laughs> no, Groovy, not there. The pink egg is behind that mound of stones. Cool, a racing car. There's one surprise egg left to find. The golden egg. Look, there it is. Catch it. Groovy has transformed into a superhero. Sure, he will be able to catch it now. You almost have it. Come on, Groovy. Great idea, Phoebe. Ah, Phoebe was faster than you. Wow, a chocolate surprise egg. You deserve it. What a great teamwork. And what cool toys. Shall we go over what colors they are? The fire truck is exactly red. The excavator is yellow. The police car is, that's it, blue. The race car is pink. Don't eat too much chocolate and enjoy the spring. Hello, kids. Today is a very special day. It's Halloween! Phoebe, do you have your costume ready? No? Still no costume? We need to fix that. Sure, there has to be something inside that closet to dress up Phoebe and Groovy. <laughs> what is that? Is someone there? Mom and Dad. Lucky you. They've brought you new Halloween costumes. Children, what do you think Phoebe and Groovy will be wearing? Whoa, your costumes are awesome! What a clumsy fall, Groovy! Be careful! Look how many kids have costumes! So fun! Are we going to ask for candies too? Cool! Hey kids, do you know what you have to say now? 
Exactly. <laughs> Trick or treat! Great. They've given you lots of candies. <laughs> Groovy doesn't like them, though. He likes broccoli more. Hmm, Groovy, where are you taking us? This house is a bit far away. I think we'd better come back. Better inside. Watch out. What a bump. That cat is like a watchdog. Oh, it's a house of a witch. Oh, thank God. It's just a granny. Groovy, you don't have any costume. Transform into something for the trick-or-treat. Trick-or-treat! <laughs> Groovy has gotten away with it. He's pigging out on broccoli. Remember, kids, if you do not want to have your belly hurt afterwards, do not eat all the goodies at once. Happy Halloween. Aw, oh, it's time to get them up, but I just can't. They are too sweet. Look, a little spider. Come on, it's just a cute spider. You see, you have nothing to worry about. Is it Lucas the spider? <laughs> so fun. I have an idea. Groovy, transform into a giant spider. We can tour the city like Spider-Man. Yay, the city is our kids. What fun. <laughs> we look like superheroes. Oh no! Well, we scared her! It's not our fault. Her little puppy has run away. We have to help her rescue the puppy. Come, Groovy. You almost have it. Try to grab the puppy's leash. Let's try again. Be careful with the road. There are too many cars. Come on, Groovy. One more time. Oh, no! Haha! <laughs> Great! You did it! Very good, children! You are superhero babies for her! Good job! All who strive to be kind to others, we are superheroes. There's nothing better than a great breakfast to start the day. Right, Groovy? He has eaten his and Phoebe's. Time to go. Phoebe is so hooked on her new mystery book that in the end, she will be late to school. When you are in a hurry, the best is the tricycle. No traffic jam, no contamination, and you do some sport. Oh, 
Oh no, you got a flat tire and we are in a hurry. Who could have been? Good idea, Phoebe. This is a mystery for a super detective. Groovy, Phoebe needs a magnifying glass. Help her. This is a case for Phoebe Holmes and Dr. Groovy. Today, in the flat tire mystery. What a hole! To find the guilty, the first to do is look for clues. What do we have here? Hmm, three clues. First one seems like a dog footprint. Second one, a human footprint. And third, a bird footprint. Where should we start? First one. There we go. Number one clue, dog's footprints. Careful, Phoebe. That mutt looks suspicious. Let's question him. Groovy, transform into a dog and take his bone. Mr. Dog, do you know something about the flat tire of this girl's tricycle? The dog is not guilty. He has an alibi. He is chained. Poor dog, he couldn't leave his garden. It's really late, let's hurry up. First clue wasn't good, let's continue with the second one. Second clue, human's footprint. Another false clue. These are Phoebe's footprints on her way from home. Third clue, bird's footprints. Mystery solved. It has been this woodpecker that has pierced the wheel with its beak. It's elemental, my dear Groovy. Let's go, kids. There's no time to lose. The mystery has been solved, but not the problem. We can't use the tricycle, and you have to arrive to school on time. Have you thought the same as me? by the skin of your teeth. Remember kids, if you want to arrive on time, you have to leave with time. You never know what can happen on the way. No clues are needed to know that this mischief has been Phoebe's idea. Elementary, my dear children. Phoebe and Groovy are playing tag in the loft. Be careful, kids. Don't hurt yourself. What's that? Looks like a treasure map. Oh, and that's a pirate hat. Who's gonna wear it?
<laughs> run, baby, run! But Phoebe, are you sure the map says the treasure is there? And how are you going to dig up the treasure? Groovy, you can transform into a shovel. Seems there's no sign of the treasure, right, Mr. Mole? Kids, why don't you check the map again? There's no treasure here. Wow, a secret passage. How cool. Surely it will take us to the treasure. too dark. This is a little scary. I know. Groovy, why don't you transform into something shiny? What was that? Hmm, so weird. Well, let's keep going. Look, guys, we're at the beach. I'm sure the treasure is nearby. Will the treasure be buried here? Watch out! The parrot has taken the map. Now it is impossible to know where is the treasure. Kids, don't be sad. We're having a great time, even if we don't find the treasure. We're at the beach. Why don't we build a sandcastle? <laughs> what? Is it the treasure? How exciting! What will be inside? What is it? A boat inside a bottle? I can't believe it! It's a pirate ship! All aboard, kids! So fun! Something tells me we're going to live a great adventure. Phoebe and Groovy are living a real adventure. But they don't know. There's intruders on board. The famous Treasure Island. We are getting close. Oh no! They've taken the only boat. They want to be the first to arrive to keep the treasure for themselves. Groovy, quick, transform into a boat. <laughs> but with a motor, quick. <laughs> well done, Groovy. This is super exciting. Groovy speeds up and shows what he's capable of. Really good. Champions. Uh-oh. 
It smells like trouble. The island is not empty. Kids, don't worry. We'll find the way to get out of here. But Pops, where are you going? Look, guys, this must be the head of the tribe. Pops, he makes them believe he's their god. You can't complain. Thanks to Pops, they treat you like kings now. Be afraid. The pirate needs your help to dig up the treasure. Haha, <laughs> kids. We'll know what is inside soon. The pirate has a plan. You have to work all together to get the treasure. Ah, oh, what a beautiful day to... Run! Now that everyone is pursuing Pops, you can dig up the treasure. Don't you know how to do it? Try working all together. Wow, working all together, you made it. How cool. Kids, I know you want to know what is inside the treasure chest. But first, why don't we check on Pops and the Pirate? They managed to hide. Thank God. Let's go back to the village. What's the treasure hidden inside it? Another pirate hat? It's a magic hat. Is his girlfriend... She was trapped in the hat by a pirate curse. You've saved her. Good job. Run, they've discovered you. Groovy, we have to escape. Transform into a sledge and ride the dunes. This story has a great end because you all have worked all together to get the treasure. Remember, kids, if you can't all be your own, you sure can with your friends.
Hey Johnny Yes Papa Eating sugar No Papa Telling lies No Papa Open your mouth Johnny, Johnny Yes, Papa Eating sugar No, Papa Telling lies No, Papa Open your mouth trying to say something? Oh yes, subscribe kids! Groovy the Martian, official channel.